Okay. It's good to be back. Oh, let me move this. That's gonna slide. That's gonna slide. No, that's gonna rub. Oh gosh, I'm sorry about this. I'm gonna put it. I'm gonna just pinch it right here. There we go. Cool. It is good to be back. Uh, so, yeah, there was no no videos taken whilst I was out in LA. Didn't have bloody time. So, oh, landed back yesterday at about, I want to say half three. And then uh, we, well, I, actually no, Chris in the car, so yeah, we, we works. Um, got home after dropping him off and waiting for everything and waiting for my car and all that. Um, I don't think it got home until it gone nine o'clock. So it was a long, long day yesterday and I was in work this morning for eight. So yeah, long all day. However, it's good to be back. But yeah, there were no videos filmed over there. Um, that was because every day we had something to do. So we went Disneyland, we went hockey, we went to the NBA, we went to Universal, we went to Hollywood. So yeah, there wasn't a day that went by that um, wasn't full of activities, which was really, really good. Um, only thing that I kind of wish we got a chance to do was go to the other Disney parks. We went to Disneyland, not Disney, like Adventure World or whatever it's called. Like, if we had an extra day, it would have been great to do that. However, I'm still super stoked on what we did. Like, it was a really, really fun day. Really, really, really good day. Um, I am... Um, excited for today though you know train again i haven't trained for a while uh the new mic turned up uh, i just need to get the right cable to connect to my phone now i've got the usb c the 3.5 mil adapter but um it's something to do with the actual 3.5 mil cable that comes with the road mic it's not the right one that'll connect to a phone so yeah but that's on order that'll arrive tomorrow so hopefully sunday's video will have that in uh but yeah Let's go. So today is chest. Chest is best. So I'm just finishing work and heading down the ramps. And then we'll be heading over to uh, UFIT to train. Didn't go to Gold's when I was over in uh, LA. The, uh, the motel that we were staying at did have like a fitness suite, which was like some cardio kit. I went there once, but... There was just really no sort of, um, what's the word I'm looking for? There was just no time. Like it was going to take me 10 minutes to get to and from um, Gold's Gym, plus training for like two hours, like if you think about cardio and all that as well. I, I wasn't sleeping much over there. Um, I, well, you're having troubles with the, with the, exit ramp there uh wasn't sleeping much wasn't uh on my normal diet and all that and i just didn't see the point in me putting myself through that because I, I didn't want to uh essentially have a crap session over there so i just didn't go and i was having you know it's nice to have some time away and just you know relax um but really, really fun. Really, really fun. I'll probably talk more about that on the car ride home. But for now, we're going to talk about today's session. Hopefully, it's not going to be busy over there. I'm realizing it's rush hour when I'm going there now. But I'm hoping it's going to be okay. I'm hoping it's going to be chill. I've got to hit some heavy incline work. And then... some side laterals as well so just sipping on the pre now I'm going to try and keep it basic when I get in there I'm looking forward to doing the cardio afterwards and sweating for a little bit I've got to plug my um, my numbers into my sheet then for my macro tracking and see where I'm at but yeah it's going to be a good one I'm looking forward to it I'm excited it's been a long day. Well, it's been a long couple of days. Uh, 
I don't really know where I am time-wise at the moment, but we're getting there. Uh, but yeah, I'm happy to be back. Uh, for those of you that missed the content, I'm sorry that I left you for so long, but here I am, back once again. So I'm going to go in, I'm going to enjoy my pre, and I'm going to warm up, and I'll see you for top set of the first movement. All right, so, sorry, sorry. Um, good fun to get back to it, but it's just that V loud in here tonight. So chances are this music is going to cause the video to get uh, muted, which is fine. I'll just do a voiceover. So if you can hear this, great. If not, then uh, we will try again as we always do. But last set of advice uh, being pressed now. Started off at uh, 60s, uh, 12, then 7. So I've dropped down to 50 now. Just going to see how much we can uh, get out and uh, see where it was next. Ideally, I'd want to do Smith Machine next. Um, but it all depends on uh, how busy it is. May end up with a death fly, may end up with some flat press, may end up with some uh, different different incline press, but we'll see. Uh, oh, I feel like I get clean a week off as, a, as an impact, so. <laughs> ah. Oh, oh my face. You know, you can see what all this stuff we've been on to. Sorry. Oh. That's a strong thing. Jump on this machine. The uh, Atlantic's flat press. Just keep the fact that everything else is busy. Um, five plates on the side of there, and I'm not sure how that's going to go. There is almost really well. My last warm up. So if I can get like six to eight out on this, so close to grip, then I'm not going to complain. So let's see what happens. Oh, oh, oh. There's no one that, is there? You want to take that? Oh. One more track of that. Bring some isolation work if we can get out something. Okay, so that's that. Uh, this is a bit quick. Thank you. 
gosh. Just give me some side doubts. Oh. Jeez, I'm going to go Use the phone bench. Uh, sorry, I'm not sure. Oh. Oh. oh, gosh. I can't remember why I haven't done them for years. So, this is the final set now. Uh, those inside bench side laterals were very painful in a good way. Um, it's a pretty good way of isolating everything out because you can't swing. Uh, but we up these now to finish up. So, usually the other way around how it normally works, but it's just how things work when it gets to a busy gym at the gala. It is getting quite full again now, so I'll be very happy to know the set done and get out of the way of the party to sort of hide the way for 20 minutes or 30 minutes. Let's just get this now. Oh. Oh. Well, that's that. Uh, first session back done. Oh, not this time. Okay. So that's the session done. Um, I'm happy with how that went. It was good. I felt weird being in there. I kind of got in my own head at the start of the <clears throat> when I left the car. I don't know why. Uh, so yeah, it was good to just get in there and get it done. Did like a decent, well, matched reps on uh, the incline pin press, PB'd on the flat press. I'm not sure how, just one of those things. Um, and then the pack deck fly was good as well inclined shoulder raises were horrific in a good way and side laterals were what they were meant to be so yeah finished up with 30 minutes on the stairs then i can't fault it a really good session with it really good first session back nice to get some of the jet lag moving nice to get some of the the water that i'm holding moving as well so yeah really really happy with that i'm just drinking this uh way shake now but what I am going to do is turn this off and start heading home because it's about 20 to 9 and I don't particularly want to be up super late well I'm going to be anyway because this is me but still I hope you can still see me I'm not turning on the in-car lights like I said my dad always told me that was illegal and I know it's not however I don't want to risk anything also can't be asked. um <laughs> But yeah, I'm, I'm really happy to be back training. Uh, hopefully, I mean, I might be able to train tomorrow. I might not. We'll see, because I might have some plans after work. So, not 100% sure yet. Uh, but if not, Sunday will be back for the, the back session. Uh, 
Uh, that's just my car telling me to check the tyre pressure, which I've been meaning to do for about a week now. So I will do that tomorrow because I am a responsible adult who definitely hasn't forgotten about that every morning so far. Um, but yeah, that's that's going to be the plan for back. But that's another session where I'm just really happy with how that all went and uh, just nice to be back in the groove with things. Uh, nice to be back in a busy gym as well. Um, I quite I keep my head down. I know I film these videos, um, but I'm not someone that goes out of their way to cause a scene or anything in the gym. Like I, I, ironically, I make these YouTube videos, but I hate being noticed, like doing anything or anything like that. Like I hate people like paying attention to me. Um, sounds really strange to say that, but it's just kind of like I'm in my, I'm, I'm in my own little world with that. Same with like when I was powerlifting, I was in my own little world. I quite like being there. Um, I guess if you spend a lot of energy focusing on looking flamboyant in the gym and showing off, like, you know, yeah, if you're having fun, then great. Like, as long as you can keep doing that and having fun, then, then you're making progress, then good. But I found that I didn't enjoy that type of person, like being that type of person, I should say. Um, so yeah, I just quite like to stick on some music, put my head down and ideally stick my hood up and then just go with it see what see what we get out but yeah i do appreciate everyone who comes along for the ride on these vlogs um it is fun it is um something i'm enjoying doing so i just hope that i can keep on doing it but we'll see um so the plan for the night now is i've got about seven to eight hundred calories left which is quite a lot considering that it's 20 to 9 so i'm going to go home and get some cereal maybe some granola as well and just see what I can throw together in the kitchen because it's going to just be a mishmash of food to try and hit my macros but I'll see what we get uh, but yeah tomorrow or well, the next session is back which is always fun um, but I'm feeling a little sleepy so I'm going to try and stay awake well I am going to stay awake if you're watching this, I stayed awake as I head home, and then I'm gonna eat and chill, and I'm gonna do it all over again tomorrow. Finish a little bit later tomorrow, and the gym shuts a little bit earlier. So if I if my plans fall through after work, then I should still be able to get a back session in without a problem. But no morning cardio because I start at eight, so I won't be able to get to the gym beforehand because the gym in my hometown opens at six. So, I mean, if I was really pushing it, I could get there for six, but I'd have to leave at... No, I wouldn't have time, because... If I got there for six and left at, like, 25 to 7, if I cleaned the machine down and, like, got my stuff together and all... Uh, gives me 25 minutes to get home, have breakfast, and no. Get ready for work and leave... So I had to leave like an hour before work so I got some time to come in. So no, that's not happening. So yeah, no morning cardio until I start at nine or later. Uh, but at the moment we're enjoying this. I say we are enjoying this. Like it's been one session, but it's been good. So yeah, we'll see what happens. We'll see what goes on. Uh, however, that's going to be it for me for tonight. Uh, as always, if you are resting today, I'm jealous um, I've just had five days of rest, if not a little bit longer, so I know exactly how you feel and I am very envious of you. I hope that you're enjoying it, I hope that you are making the most and I hope that you are relaxing. Not thinking about the gym, not thinking about what's going to happen tomorrow. But if you are training, I hope that everything has worked out for you. I hope that your session is flying, I hope that you're hitting PBs, be that with weight, with reps or whatever. Um, make sure you get in your one gram protein per pound of body weight make sure you're resting up proper and uh, don't forget to uh, take your multi and lift heavy and I'll see you in the next one